Hi guys, you maybe saw my birthday build when I built a red arrows hook from Ravel. This was a quite nice kit with good fit. But what about if I want to build a not so good fitting model kit? A real old one, a not usual one. No, I'm not talking about the Tamiya kit. This is a Yak-17 model kit from Dubena Chesky Dub. And it is a Waku form kit from the year 1988. Actually, this is the second time when I built this model kit. The first time I was 10. And I want to know that this is still a fun to build model kit as I remember. Or it will be a nightmare. You may say, hey Richie, you are joking, where are the sprues? Well my friend, you are looking at it at the moment. As I said, Waku form kit. This is the same fabricating technique which are used by producing Waku form canopies in your upgrade sets. Where are the decals? Oh, I've got it. It looks bad. No worries, still usable, I hope. Usually, when I have a so old kit on my desk, from another era, I used to say this is a Sotsreal build again. So I say it now, this is a Sotsreal build again. I'm planning that this will be a two parts with you, so I hope you will enjoy it. So let's build this model kit. First I separate the parts. When the parts are separated, I have to cut around the parts and sand them. Let's start gluing. 
<laughs> just joking, this awesome super thin glue is not the perfect tool for this kind of model kits. The right tool for the right job. I mean right glue for the right job. Anyway, let's use this Humbro glue. Why is it interesting to build a Baku form kit? Well, during the build you have a stronger feeling that you are forming the material to shape, comparison to a normal model kit, but it is still a plastic kit. And this model kit is surprisingly rich in details. Most normal model kits from this era doesn't even have a detailed cockpit, but this one is quite good.
I searched in my modeling boxes and I found this pilot. I don't remember where I have it from, but it wearing similar uniform like the first Soviet jet pilots. This is the first upgrade what I did on this kit so far. This Yak-17 will fly. The nut will be the connecting point to the stand. We are near to the end of this episode. In the next episode I will finish this model kit and I will show the result. If you like this part, well, you know what to do. Thank you for watching.